Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to a new video. Um, in today's video, we have Snow D. Crow, one of the highest ranked players in the game right now. Um, Snow D, you can uh, tell a little bit about yourself. What's up, guys? I'm Snow D. Uh, I am a player of uh, Harry Potter Magic Awakening as well. I just started the game on the 27th, on the global release. I played like for one day before it in the Canadian server just to see how it was, but I have no prior experience. And I have to learn about the game uh, on YouTube channels, like uh, videos like Green put out, helped me a lot on that. Uh, Thank you. And I, I, I had the objective when I started the game to be first in South America. Uh, I am... I live in the Netherlands, but I'm from Brazil, so I, I play in the Brazilian server with my friends. I get a bit of a lag, but uh, it's doable. And my, my target was to be first in South America. I, I am first in South America right now. My target is is being hold, uh, and I'm second on the world at this, this exact moment. But they're, they're catching up, so I don't know how long I will hold this position. <laughs> yeah, that was a very nice introduction indeed. Okay, so now tell us a little bit about your main deck that you use to climb up the ranks. So when I have to choose a deck, I have two things in mind. First is that I am not very good mechanically with the game yet, so I okay. have not built up the mechanical uh, ability, like uh, the mechanical muscles, mm -hmm. like uh, the muscle memory, uh, and that I play in a server that my ping is quite high. So my ping is between 100 and 200, so Ooh. it's hard for me to, to, to do a good snipe with spells. So yeah. for that reason, I choose to focus on my unit. Uh, so I play mainly a Hagrid deck mm -hmm. with locomotors. I was lucky enough to get a plus two locomotor uh, in my Hagrid, Ooh. so it's quite strong right now. The okay. locomotors are level 16 on this deck. Pretty uh, I focus strong. on them, I trade every single token with them. I use our wild legend archives in my locomotors and try to make them as strong as, as possible. Mm -hmm. When my locomotor deck, now in Magic Awakening, I have them banned all the time. So I play either Bellatrix or my... Uh, Newt deck. Okay. Uh, Newt preferably, but if I go against someone that has a Bellatrix, I have a really hard time to have a good end game against it. I have a mid game very well, in the end game just everything falls apart because I don't have enough uh, to come down with their with their Death Eaters that comes into the, into yeah. the, the arena at the end. But yeah. uh, mainly uh, Hagrid, I claim with Hagrid from until Magic Awaken, and then now I, I sometimes I have to swap from my Hagrid. But uh, it's fine. I still can get some wins with other decks as well. They, they, the mechanic is not too far away, right? If you play Newt or Hagrid. Yeah, I wanted to same. say this. Like, Newt and Hagrid, like, mm, often you play, like, a lot of the same cards, a lot of the same spam yeah. cards, let's say it this way. So I also, like, often have, like, almost the same deck with Newt and uh, Hagrid. It's just like with Hagrid, if you have a big boy like Locomotor or Opali, well, he gets healed and yeah. it has like more pressure. Um, so I think also that right now in the meta overall, Hagrid is way, way stronger than Newt. Um, his ability is just like... It, it, yeah, it's just way better than Newt's uh, ability. But yeah, hyped to see some of your games because I already saw that one of the games is against Sponge, the highest level player in the world right now. Spellbook level tw no, 120, right? Yeah, he's a, he, oh, he reported man. to me that he becomes 120 now. <laughs> okay, so uh, at the game that you sent me, he was a little bit lower. He was probably Yeah, he was a bit lower. I think he was around 111. Oh, 111, so low. Yeah. <laughs> Crazy. Okay, I would say let's just uh, check out some gameplays and then you will try to tell us why you play it that way and your ideas behind the place. Yeah, okay, see, so you ban immediately Bella. Mm -hmm. Yeah, his Bella is really hard for me to, to deal with. Okay, see. And he, he's usually banning my... I, I don't think he cares what he bans on my deck, he just wants, you know? <laughs> hmm. The challenge. He would ban my Hagrid if he want a, a Sir win there. Oh, uh, I see. Oh my god, okay. Hide for this game. Yeah. Th this is a nice game. I really like this one. He's held. Yeah, his health is quite high. And uh, I made a lot of mistakes in this start. You're gonna see it. Okay. So now he's hiding himself, but... Uh, mm -hmm my locomotor got him before my my monster book because i usually i, I play monster book mainly for the for the cloud right oh uh, yeah it makes totally sense i do the same to be honest yeah wow it's um so he's playing a very swarming deck yeah i see 
Oh wow, okay, you used incendio there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I use a very bad incendio. That's good, like the bombs really helped you out a bit in... Uh, yeah, because they explode all the, the swarm, right? Yeah, yeah, like when there's no units on the board, he just protects your, like, attacks nearby units. A lot of people don't know that yet, but... Yeah, there I decide to wait a bit, because anything I put in there, it will be instant kill. Mm -hmm. So I decide to hold a bit and bring down my locomotor soon. There, here you say I lost, right? There's yeah. no way to. <laughs> like, for real, anymore. like, I was like, wow, how did you even come back um, after yeah, that, that start? Was, uh... I but think yeah. I started to pay attention to the game eventually. <laughs> <Just> <laughs> okay, okay. To... But yeah, suddenly, that, that like. Monster book, I, I memorized the position of the box and just sent the monster book there. Yeah, like the. the... Yeah, insane with the thing you want. Oh, those kinds of plays. Just... Wow. Make 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 it work at the end. Ah, Ron, okay. Here, okay. just wait for his home to come over, yeah, and then yeah. I swarm him easily. Ron is quite easy to to counter. You just wait mm -hmm. for for it to hit you, and then you just put in down whatever you have to. Yeah, true. And then you just start a full uh, full push. Oh wow! Yeah. The main thing here was being very patient, not getting ahead of myself, trying to use my resources to counter whatever he has something. And then, as you can see, that I was able to overcome at the end because he got a bit desperate in the end. You can see, yeah, he's yeah, I not saw really it. knowing what to do, but then I was a bit over able to overcome the. It uh, it was crazy because like in the beginning it was like GG game over, but then yeah. suddenly. Bam, it totally changed. Like the it's, it switched yeah. totally. Suddenly it clicked in my uh, mind. I say, okay, I know what I have to do. <laughs> I'll just keep my patience, like be calm and I'll be able to do it. Yeah, luckily you didn't panic too much. You yes. hold it together and that's wow, crazy. That's how you win against the highest level player in the world. Okay, but wow, four thousand eight hundred health. <laughs> it looks crazy yeah. to me to be honest. Wow. It's a lot of it's a lot of health to take off. It is. Okay, Chinese player means... Yeah, maybe they already played the, the um, Taiwan version of the game. Oh, wow, that was fast. Yeah, they probably play already the Taiwan game. I am I'm, I, I go against Chinese, Japan. I'm against Ace players a lot because mm -hmm. I usually play on this time of the day and usually they are the ones playing as well. Oh, okay, I see, I see, I see. Here's a bit more balance. I mean, I, I, I'm at 500 HP ahead, right? Oh, but true. It's... It's... Yeah. I mean, that, yeah, that happens. That Cassandra in the corner is my nightmare. It's it is, so hard right. To do it that. is. <laughs> that's does... why I keep my, my Centaur in my deck. Yeah. He's so them. good against yeah. that, yeah. How uh, Lokomoto already liked um, the player's favorite cards. I saw it in my streams and so on. People yeah. love it. They, they, yeah, it's very high in in, in the meta right now, and it's they crazy. are saying that they maybe they will ban this card. We, we I think we, next week we get to vote a card to ban, right? Mm, yeah, game. yeah, right, 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 right. And uh, this is one of the highest there to to be voted uh, to ban. The problem with that is is that also a lot of people play the card. So will they ban a card that they play themselves? Hmm. Yeah, we, that's we'll what see. I was thinking as well. <laughs> Okay. Here, one of the mistakes I did here was putting my Niffler 2 ahead, like I should be putting a little bar in the back. Yeah. And I, I'm very Ooh. bad against those water balls, mm -hmm. mainly because of my leg, but because I, now I, I wrote some videos on how to counter them. Yeah. I'm getting better at it, but it, it is quite uh, annoying for me, like I quite... Orb of Water can be um, crazy. I'm also surprised yeah. to see, like, um, as I saw on the new server, that a few people play, indeed, Orb of Water and Thunderstorm in the same deck, which surprises me. Yeah. But, uh, it we seemed have to work. the players, we say, the all legendary players, that they play all legendary card they have in the deck. So, oh. You know, 
I, I will tell you, I, I'm, I'm ashamed that I have lost to those decks before, but that's for <laughs> players like I have a level 16, 17 cards. Yeah, <laughs> and I, it happens. It's really hard to deal with uh, those levels of... Yeah. yeah, of course, of course, of course, I understand. Yeah, he did a very good wall of water here. But uh, yeah. I was able to, <laughs> to snatch the win at the end. Oh, wow, yeah, it's only pum, it's over. Yeah. Interesting, interesting. The only thing I can tell you is don't stay like too far ahead on the front row. I think that's one of the main problems I see in your place because he, it was really easy to catch you with the orb of water because you were always like not in the back of your yes. board but always on the front. Um, yes, that's the I will. Thing I notice. I have a reason to do that. I know it's not correct. I try to get my games, uh, the wing, as fast as I can so I okay. can move to the next one. And when I see <laughs> that the player is lower than I am, I just try to get a quicker win. So I go ahead to put my status on his side. Oh, I but see. yeah, you're right. I should not. I just, I just want to rush to get to the end. At that time, I was trying to get to top one again. So yeah. because the problem you are, is, you are uh, definitely correct. I should not be in the front like that. I mean, I understand it totally. The problem is that you will get used to this, to that playstyle. And once yes, the enemies get yeah. harder, then your brain will be like, ah, ah, I want to do the same. But uh, yeah, I mean, that's just a small thing. We all have like uh, some uh, weird place that we do sometimes. But yeah, we yeah, all are we, have... we are still learning all. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I've just started, right? I have a week. <laughs> yeah, that's crazy, crazy, crazy. Yeah. Uh, a weekend we spellbook level seventy-eight. Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> tell us the <laughs> secret, me, please. Experience? Uh, yeah, uh, it's a uh, working. <laughs> oh wow, working. Okay. Thanks for the tip. <laughs> Thanks for the tip. I appreciate <laughs> it. Thanks so <laughs> Yeah, I'm not. I'm not free to play. You know that. <laughs> oh, I thought you were. Okay, good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh my god. Okay, here, well, will he play like uh, will he play yeah, Neville? I, I, I think so, yes. Oh. He's a he's bow on the Hagrid because probably one of his strongest deck there. Oh yeah, 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 you yeah. You can yeah, see yeah. he play Locomotor, he played the Dragon. Dragon is quite a good counter to my Locomotors. Yeah, it is. It definitely is true. I go Locomotor here because I think I can be a bit more aggressive. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Here I do a mistake. I send my monster book before seeing his Cassandra. <laughs> oh yeah, wow! Cassandras are my ban. They are mm -hmm. so annoying. Well, that's like really annoying. Like Cassandra and the egg next to her. Ooh, you, 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 yeah. you, you. Oh, you, 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 you. I send the pixies. My my idea here is to get the bombs there and try to sneak some bombs in because I don't really have any other card that would help in this situation yeah. at that moment. Now I have the center, it's a bit better. But he's so packed on that corner. Yeah. But um, like the bombs really helped. They killed the egg in the end. Yeah. Ivy second spot is actually very good. Yeah. Usually I use the Ivy to, to get rid of Cassandra's and uh, and Ronis, but in this case, I cannot really reach his Cassandra. <laughs> oh yeah, 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 yeah. And by using my Ivy, he also used his Ivy now, what give me a free range on my Ronnie later. Yeah, true. It's so hard to kill those Cassandras. Yeah, <laughs> I need to level my Sandy. My Sandy is like level 11, I think. That's, yeah. That's already not too bad, though. But, yeah. And the problem is he heals her up the whole time. So you can... Yes. And then he does this. Oh, my God. Yeah. Oh he, didn't my use God. His, uh, he didn't use that spell until now. I didn't know he had it. <laughs> wow. Otherwise, I would have saved my... my in my book, I mean. Yeah. Here is always the same. Let him hit me and then put the locomotors down. Four locomotors. Ay, ay, ay. Yeah, here I just decide to go all 
Oh my god. I win because I say I'm not killing his Cassandra. Oh. I just try to get in as much damage as I can. I hit a good incendio there. Four locomotors, that was really scary. <laughs> really yeah, and scary. then I was able to kill him with my center. <laughs> oh my god, what a finish. You, you can see those those can get really out of hand, right? Wow, this is really well, you can end up dying there. You can't, like you can build up too much. There was a one game, I don't have it anymore, but there was one game that the guy got like a uh, several eggs, several things in the corner, and then it was just crazy. A confringo there would do a lot of damage, but I didn't have it. True, true. Confringo can totally change uh, a game like this. It's uh, it's true, it's true. Okay, so that was it from this video, guys. It was very fun, I think. Also very nice to have uh, another high-ranked player on the channel. Okay, so Snowdy, do you have like one or some last words for new players or people that are just getting into the game, like some tips or what should they take care yeah. about? I mean, mainly have fun in the game. Don't don't think too much about it. Uh, if you want to go high ranking, look for good, good, other good players. Look for good decks. You are able to win against stronger people in this game. Uh, but the game does match you against people that are average, same level book as you are. I realize that by climbing. So don't feel too much uh, bad that people have so much higher level books because the game will help you out on this. As well and it is possible to win against people with a higher rank i have lost to some avada cadabras myself quite low levels of avada oh, yeah <laughs> avada <laughs> yes you just have fun and uh play what you like i think it's it's just a, it's a game to have fun nothing else matters i think that's the yeah, thing i mean it's a game it should be fun and i know like losing games can be frustrating but mm -hmm. If you're too frustrated, I mean, take a small break, get some drinks, whatever, fresh air, and then just yes. play uh, more later. But yeah, it's it's a competitive game, right? You lose some, you win some. It's just the game. Yes. It is what it is. And yeah, um, on my ladder, yeah. several times I, I was like losing three in a row. I say, okay, yeah. I need to take a break. <laughs> That's true, <laughs> right? Because if you're also it's, like frustrated, yeah. you play. I think you make more misplays. Yeah. Uh, because then you're nervous and I'm like, ah, I want to rush it. I want to get the wins back. And then it's like, oh no, I did like more misplays. I, I, I lost more. And uh, yeah, I don't yeah. think this is uh, it. Um, you have a known YouTube channel, right? Yes, but I don't really post there anymore. It, it is also target to Portuguese speakers uh, community. Okay. I do my videos in Portuguese. Mm -hmm. I heard you speak Portuguese, right? I, I heard that. Yes, I também posso falar português. Oh, that's <laughs> yes, nice. yes, 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 yes. <laughs> that's true. Uh, <laughs> either way, I will um, put your social links down below. If you guys are interested in it, just give him a follow, uh, subscribe, whatever. Um, it was would be very appreciated. And um, yeah, leave comments right, down thank below. You. Thank you for having me. Thank you for the videos. I thank here. you also for being here. I <laughs> mean, me a lot of your content. <laughs> it's uh, it's very nice to have like uh, other players here and sharing their experiences in the wizarding world. And um, yeah, it was super fun. You were a very nice guest. <laughs> I need to say it. Super pleasant. And um, yeah, I hope to see you on rank one in the future in the world that would be super nice i um let's, fingers let's crossed it. it's a lot of grind you know that right it's a lot of grinding it's <laughs> a lot of grind but get it now because once yeah. we soft launch players can enter your duels i will take the number one spot take oh, note i will try my, it <laughs> my last countdown <laughs> all right yeah it would be fun to play against you i mean i have a lot yeah. to learn i, think, I uh, with the soft players i think uh, right now we're playing against people that are not soft players so they do a lot of mistakes and we can uh exploit those mistakes a lot in the fights true 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 it's true and, uh, later on it becomes more high high level it'll be harder to exploit mistakes but which is quite nice, right? So you have to avoid to do mistakes yourself. It, it is just uh, up and up. It, it, I love this part of the game, you know, getting better and yeah, it's like the, as a player. It's the beginning yeah. and like the, the it's the where you learn the most, where you learn all the cars, how they work, the mechanics and so on. Yeah. So it's the, probably the most fun time. Um, yeah, but it will... Yeah. I'm very hyped once we can play against uh, all the new players and uh, because, yeah... Our yeah, situation I'm far away is not from good. Being the best player, any, anyhow, but I'm very 
try hard. So <laughs> I compensate with try harding. Try harding <laughs> is like the key to success in a competitive game, I must admit. Yeah. That was it. Thanks for watching the video. Uh, leave a like and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. And I would say see you on the next video. Bye bye.